Good afternoon guys, Zali from Roman Motor Company. We got a 2012 Porsche Cayenne S and this car is a beautifully spec car with lots and lots of good options on it. I'm actually gonna go over the options for my phone because there's so many packages, I don't wanna miss any. But uh, it is a Cayenne S, it's uh, very low miles, about 60,000 miles or so. We've already dry ice blasted this thing, fully paint corrected. I've personally driven this thing a good five, 600 miles or so. Drives absolutely perfect. We're gonna go over some of the details that the car has as far as spec goes. We're gonna show you some of the imperfections and then give you some shots of the car so you can get a more closer look to it. Let's take a look at it. So first things first, maintenance. Uh, it's only a two owner car. Pretty much since day one, all the maintenance has been uh, done at Porsche dealerships and it's always been in California. So underneath the car looks absolutely perfect. There's no rust, there's no corrosion. Overall, very, very clean car. And every single maintenance is up to date. When we got it, we essentially just did an oil change, the alignment on it, paint correction, graphene coating, and dry ice blasting. Now, Let's talk about paint correction. So what you see here is a black paint, obviously. Typically, you will see lots of swirls, imperfections, the paint feels kind of rough. But what we do with all our cars is we do a full paint correction. What that is is the process of polishing the paint. We remove all the swirls, all the scratches. Within reason, some of the stuff will still stay on there because we can't burn the paint. And then we graphene coat it. So that's what gives it this nice, beautiful finish. And when the sun hits it, all you see is just a nice, spec of the sun being on the car, no swirls, no spider webs. So as far as the spec goes, I don't want to miss any of the uh, important options on there. So first things first that stands out is going to be these turbo wheels. It's got the P0 tires on it. Those are the uh, 21 inch 911 turbo two wheels. The price on that was $5,200. I looked at that and I was like, holy crap, that's high. So that's one of the main things that stands out. It's got the Porsche air suspension as well. So that's the PASM and then the power seats that we're gonna show you on the interior. And then this also has the premium package, which is about an $11,000, $12,000 package. The car is equipped with that. Most of the Cayennes that you guys see is not gonna be as well equipped as this one. So that's why you wanna make sure we mention all of those uh, so you guys can uh, know those before you bid on the car. Let's go look at the interior of the car. All right, looking at the interior of the car. Very, very clean, uh, smells really good. There's non-smoker car. Smells very much like a brand new car, I would say. Dashboard, door panels, center console, everything was very, very clean. The only imperfection that we mentioned on the description as well is gonna be this little rip right here on the seat. We'll get a close up of that. And it does have the 14-way seats, very comfortable. It does have the Bose audio package, which is great, sounds really, really good. And then all the center console, controls and everything's right here, your four-wheel drive system, the height control, all the adjustments for the audio as well as the um, AC is in here and all the buttons look great, there's no blemishes, there's no wear and tear. Uh, speaking of the interior, steering wheel looks great, I don't see any abnormal wear and tear. The carpets look beautiful, there's actually extra carpets that came with this car, plastic floor mats that were on top so that's kept it very very clean. The headliner is in beautiful shape, I don't see any blemishes or wear and tear. And then overall, uh, while we're talking about the blemishes, wear and tear on this car, like I mentioned earlier, I have put a couple hundred miles on this car myself. It drives absolutely perfect. Uh, suspension feels good, engine feels good, there's no leaks, there's no check engine light, no warning lights, uh, brakes feel good. Overall, uh, a very, very solid car. Let's take a look at the engine as well while we're here. All right, engine bay. Uh, not much to see here, obviously a fully stock engine bay. We can talk about the maintenance. Once again, everything is done at Porsche. When we received this car, we did not have to do anything other than the regular oil change, alignment, basic stuff like that. Everything else was up to date. The only thing we did was just dry ice blast the whole car and make sure it looks just like a brand new car underneath and as far as engine may go. So let's take a look at that and then we'll talk about the imperfections. All right, imperfections. First things first, we got a tiny little dent type damage right here. Very hard to see, but at certain angles you can see it. There's that, we got a little chip right here and right here in the plastic section. We'll get a close up of that. Pictures will be better on that. We got another chip right here. This section might be, seems like a chip on the paint. I don't think it's a crack. Driver's side looks very clean overall. We got one little ding right here. Let's mention that. And then coming up to the passenger side, the flares look good, everything looks good. The wheels, we'll take pictures of it. I don't see too many curb rash, but we'll have close ups of that obviously. So coming up to the rear section, a couple things to mention. We got a couple scratches right up top, maybe when the door was opening or closing, hit something. On the rear bumper, we got a handful of scratches, I would say in this whole section. And luggage, I would say most likely is from luggage. So this section is to be mentioned, we'll get a close up. Let's go to the driver's side. Very, very clean. I don't see any crazy dents. Maybe there's like a, some sort of soft dent right here. I'm not sure if that side has this line too, but I can kind of see a little bit like soft dent there. I also noticed a dent right about here. Other than that, fairly clean. Oh, we got one more thing right here as well. 
uh, certain angle, angles you can see those. So total of three. But yeah, I think that covers everything. We'll get some close-ups. We'll get some close-ups of the paint and the imperfections. I'm looking at the wheels right now. They look pretty clean. But uh, overall, to summarize it, a very, very well spec car. Really, really good mileage, great history, all Porsche maintenance um, and no rust or anything like that. So I think this should be a perfect daily driver for somebody that's really, you know, looking for a car that's not $100,000, but still in driving in style, very reliable, all maintenance up to date. It's going to be on Bring a Trailer. It might actually be live by the time we post this video and uh, no reserve as usual. Happy bidding. Good luck, guys. Thank you. Bye-bye.